What's up bass and friends? This is Mr. Bass and I thought I would share with you something I got in the mail from Pure Fishing aka Berkeley. If you remember in a previous video for the cast for cash program that I signed up for this year they sent me this hat and some baits and I showed you those and they were some pretty good lures. Well, I got a letter from them and they said, due to the coronavirus, cash for cash is canceled. Do I get a refund of my money? No. Instead, I get a white box. I got no idea what's in it. Wonder if it'll be good. Wonder if it will be worth having the program canceled. It probably was smart to cancel it because all the tournaments have stopped. Although, they are scheduled to start reopening. So, here is the letter. Dear Cast for Cash Angler, thank you for your participation in the 2020 Berkeley Cast for Cash program. As mentioned in our previous email, the extraordinary circumstances have resulted in the postponement and cancellation of many bass tournaments. Thus, we've decided to suspend the Berkeley Cast for Cash program for the remainder of the 2020 season. This decision was not made lightly. We encourage you to get outdoors and fish when and where it's safe and responsible to do so. As a thank you for trusting in the effort that we put into scientifically developing our products, we've hand-selected some of our best lures in line to help you catch more bass. And they're giving me a 30% off coupon. A lot of, I mean, this box is chock full. So this might turn out to be a good deal. First, Berkeley X5 braid. Huh. Don't know anything about Berkeley X5 braid. Gonna have to dig into it. 30 pound test. Next, the Skeet Reese Pit Boss. This, this Pit Boss is a good color. I mean, a good bait. Skywalker. Skywalker color. Hmm, wonder what that is. Let's look. Pretty cool. Next, the Berkeley Digger 6.5 crankbait. This is Moss Craw. Good color. It's got a rattle. Slow rise. Dies six and a half feet. Aggressive wobble. Next, we've got the Shaky Snake in Green Pumpkin Chartreuse. Power bait. This power bait's good stuff. It stinks, but it's good. Good stuff. Let's see. Let's see what the Shaky Snake looks like up close. Slimy, smelly, very wiggly. So it's kind of like a traditional worm on the top. Then you got the egg sac and then you got this ring fry tail with a chartreuse end. Wonder if this thing floats. Probably doesn't. Fish will hold 18 times longer on power bait there. It's got to be true. All right. The Jay Walker 100. This is a plug. Top water plug. And this color is MF Shad. Can't go wrong with a top water plug, can you? Next. Berkeley Power Bait Power Hog in Black Red Fleck. Let's see what it looks like. This is a brush hog imitation, and that's a good looking one. These flappers are really big on these compared to a brush hog. The brush hog flappers are much shorter. 
and then these appendages are actually attached. So sometimes you may want to keep it all attached and it probably moves more water that way. Or you can pull them apart. Any kind of a creature bait, brush hog type bait, it's a good deal. The Power Hog and Black Red Fleck. 18 times longer. Swim baits, a couple of swim baits. The 4.3 inch power swimmer. And the same thing, 4.3 inch power swimmer. Just different colors. This is Sexy Shad. This is IU. I'll open them up. This is the IU. Greeny, darker green on the top. Pretty good. And then the sexy shad. It's got kind of a bluish tint on the top. And on the back, sparkly. Sparkly on the back. So that sexy shad, this is a very subtle sexy shad color. Most of the time, sexy shad is a lot more prominent. All right, so two of those. And then the last thing, the fat bottom hopper, a shaky head worm, seven incher. This is watermelon. This is a big, I mean, this is a fat shaky head worm as far as shaky head worms go. Like if you were to compare this to the trick worm, this is fatter than the trick worm. It's still a little skinnier than the magnum trick worm, but it's fatter than a normal shaky head worm. Little bulbous tail. And that is watermelon. So, not a bad deal, really, when you figure I got one, two, three, four, five, six, six packs of soft plastics. Two hard baits and some braid. You know, it's nice of them to do that. At least they are, you know, trying to trying to help cover some of the loss on this thing. This whole virus thing is it's a shame. It's really got some people messed up. But hopefully you're able to find some time fishing. I hope you like this. Please uh, subscribe and share. Hit that bell for notifications. I'd greatly appreciate it. Hope you have a great day fishing. See ya.